Hey everyone, welcome back to April Nicole Design. On today's video, I'm gonna show you how to make your very own DIY Bible tabs. Everything that you need will be in the description box below. This is the paper that I chose. I love it because it's shimmery and the background is purple, which is my favorite color. So I started off with just a plain index card. I got my ruler. You want to measure the square to be one by one. Trace it out. And then I'm going to draw a line in the middle of the square for the fold line. And just cut it out. And this is going to be your template for your Bible tabs. Here's a closer look of the one by one inch square with the fold line in the middle. Now you're gonna flip over the paper and use your template to trace out each square. There's 66 books in the Bible, but I'm only going to trace out 64 tabs because first, second, and third John will be one tab. This is what it should look like when you're done cut out each tab. On my computer, I typed out each book. Make sure you spell check and also print out on plain paper to make sure that the sizing is correct. This is the paper I chose to use for my labels. Make sure you put this paper face down in your printer. Now for assembly, you're gonna take one of the tabs that you cut out, fold it in half, make sure you get a good crease in. Then you're gonna cut your labels out, make sure you get as close as you can to the word, peel the sticker off, and you wanna place the label close to the fold line as possible. Turn your label the opposite direction and stick the other label on. And this is what it looks like. Now I'm gonna take my double-sided stick roller and open up the tab and roll it on the back of the tab towards the middle. I'm going to take the tab and stick it on the first page of the first book of the Bible. Make sure when you're sticking this down that you don't cover the words on the back of the page. It should measure perfectly according to your Bible and the margins of your Bible. Repeat the assembly steps 63 times. This is the end result. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.